Well, I, I've always uh, kind of specialized in doing oil paintings of sports, sports images, stadium uh, players' portraits, action scenes. But I, I, I like the more relaxed scenes of sports too. Uh, but I've always uh, loved sports and uh, like doing portraits of coaches, kind of keeping their memories alive and their heroes to a lot of people. So in junior high, I used to sketch my classmates who were on the baseball team or football team and stuff like that. I love college, the college football and the college sports scene quite a lot. Uh, and the pros, because I, I self-publish a lot of my oil paintings and put them on my Etsy page. And you have to be a lot of legal procedures in order to do the NFL and Major League Baseball. Uh, whereas the Tiger, old Tiger Stadium, uh, that was no problem uh, doing that. Uh, in fact, the Tigers, uh, Detroit Tigers, provided that stadium print to all their Lowe's owners uh, as part of the celebration of the uh, 35th anniversary of the 84 series win. So uh, in that in that scenario I, I had a great relationship with the Detroit Tigers and again they they liked that old Tiger Stadium painting. I like oil. Uh, I you know I with pencil I'll sketch out on the canvas after I do a little of my on location reference photos or or I'll again sketch it out on pencil but with oils I can I could put washes glazes I can let the oil dry and then go over that and put a lot of content into the a lot of tone value into the painting whereas a watercolor and acrylics uh, you don't have that wide latitude uh, to make a certain effect on the oil well, I would, I would say just work your own style. Don't try to copy someone and believe in your style and, and always paint every day and improve and, and learn from other artists. Uh, but it all goes back, you're the one putting the paint on the canvas, so work your style and, and just uh, and improve it. Just keep improving and, and, and work at it.